Can we get the net? Ooh, that ain't good. Oh, that's great. Good bite. What's up, everybody? I'm out here with my brother-in-law, Alan Michael. Say hey. What's up? Uh, we're out here in a little pelican boat on a subdivision lake gonna try to catch some big bass today. Stay tuned. All right I'm gonna throw this little trick worm on this shaky head and see what we can get to bite. I don't know if uh, I don't know if room to stand up. We get tangled in the net and fall in the water. Oh there you go. I didn't take long. Can we get the net? I got a giant. <laughs> A good start. Hadn't been out here five minutes. Thing was just running with it, seems to hit the water. What kind of bait is that? Zoom from this one. Watermelon red. Last color I thought I'd be fishing after all this rain. He was up real shallow. He was right up against that dock, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. Yep. Threw it on the side of that dock, and when I reeled up my slack, he was running. I never really catch that many down here. I never caught one down here, but I had never been. I caught them down here in the summertime, especially in that little pocket when that wind's pushing up against it. Get on out of here. This troll motor sounds like a piece of crap. You'll get sick of hearing that sound by the end of the day. I'm already sick of it. <laughs> God, them idiots are fishing the fed part of the way. Really? Yeah. Oh man. Probably tearing them up too. That dock up there is so good. You can punch me in the face 29 times if I don't get the fish on this dock. <laughs> Looks like they almost fell out the boat over there. <laughs> Probably sitting in his own dock man. Probably. I'm telling you, that dock right there is blood. Looks like they got something, I thought. I think I saw them catch one earlier on. Yeah, maybe they'll move. Well, if they're catching them, they ain't going anywhere. I'm going to go right beside them if they're, if, uh, when I get to it. They're off of it now, though. I mean, they're still casting to it, but... They were too close anyway. It's not really the dock that got the fish on it. It's the stuff they sunk out in front of. Ooh, that ain't good. <laughs> Already backlash. Oh, that's great. All my spare lines got tangled in the other rod over here. Oh my god. <laughs> This is going to be like the second fishing trip in a row. I haven't been able to use this rod. Did <laughs> that hit you? Yeah. I feel like it hit something. Kind of pulled it back before it got real bad. Uh-oh. Caught another side of the dock. It's like right under the bottom. Let me fish under this dock. Go ahead. Goes out here. Like went between. I see the I see the top of it. I think the hook is just like barely caught on the other end. See the head of it popping up over there. I don't know if the hook's kind of stuck or it's just on like between the uh, boards. Yeah, it's between the boards. It's on that nail, isn't it? <laughs> A little crack right there. Yeah, I couldn't tell. Something on it. Oh yeah. Hey, there you go. That's better.
He's kind of skinny though. A little bit. Not bad. A little bigger than that other one. A little bit. That's about the average size you catch out here. Yeah. It used to be a lot bigger than that. That used to be the average. Not anymore. I think there's too many fish in here now. Maybe. You used to you wouldn't catch that many, but every time you catch one, it'd be a pretty good one. But nobody keeps any fish out here ever. Yeah. Nobody fishes it already. Besides them bimbos over there. <laughs> I have got way too many soft plastics in here. There's a lot in there. <laughs> These little finesse worms will catch them. We hardly nothing else will on the show yet. I used to only use, like I never used finesse worms, I would use just regular trick worms. Yeah. But the other day I was out here and they would not bite that regular size one and I put on the, the little bird. Yeah. It's working good so far. Yeah, I haven't had a nibble yet, and you've already caught two, so doing something right. Probably because I'm just over here backlashing and catching the side of the dock, <laughs> all of that. This is what you need right here. Three sixteenths. Yeah. Giggy head. Hookup ratio on this thing is awesome. I've had a lot of problems with hookup ratios and shaky heads. In the really? He used to use a spot remover kind. But spot removers, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what I kind. I like them because they have that flat head on it and it, I think it helps them stand up better. Yeah. And also, with that flat head, it kind of, if you bring it up and then let it fall, it'll kind of shimmy on the way down. But yeah. I just like them. I'm about to catch another one on this dot real quick. Go for it. Somebody needs to. Oh, he could one. <laughs> Gotta get a bite before I catch one. I've been just throwing it up there. Run it, rolling it off the dot. It roll off the dot like that. Name it something injured and then falling off into the water. It's hard for me to throw that shaky head very far on this uh, on this bait caster though. Oh yeah, that's why I got on the spinning rod there. Now if it's windy, I'll throw it on a bait caster with fluoro. But yeah. Because this braid and spinning rod is hard to throw in wind. Yeah, got me a little. Huh? There's stretch out in front of this side. Huh? There's something. I don't know what I got. On top of it, too. Huh. I would have known that a long time ago. Yeah. I thought I knew what all dogs had crap out in front of it. Get over there a little closer, see if I can get it off of there. Something pretty solid, whatever it is. Are you pulling us over there? Or you mean maybe? Oh, is it? Uh, I'm probably pull this over there. I was hoping I had a bite for a second, you know, but uh, can't get that lucky. Is it a good one? It's all right, about yeah, about ain't bad. Oh, oh no. <laughs> he came off right there. I saw <laughs> I saw him hooked in the roof of the mound. Yeah, he was barely hooked. So I was like, well, I got him. My boat's with him. But... Came off. <laughs> yeah, got the right angle, I guess. God, it's hard to fish out of this thing. That's why I don't even come out here when the wind's blowing. Yeah. There's another one. There we go.
Yeah, they're all about the same size. Yeah. Got a little black dot on them. Yep. What does that mean when they have the black dot? Is it like skin disease? I have no idea. Hmm. When they hit this thing, every like, single time, all it is is just a doom and then nothing but <laughs> pressure. Like there's no. Yeah. It's just you feel a one hit. They ain't even playing with it. They just, just swallowing hit. it. Just a one tap. I may have to borrow one from you. I can't get them to touch this thing. Yeah. A whole pack right here. Well, not quite a whole pack. Yeah. Put one on again. I ain't gonna stop. I wonder why they're piled on the dock. I've never called them off this dock like this. Yeah, I don't know. I picked up one or two, you know. Yeah, I think I may have to try one because I can't get anything on this uh, other worm. They're loving that one though. Okay, if I don't get no bites now, I don't have an excuse. Keep thinking maybe one of these is going to be a good one. Caught a lot of good ones out here. Yeah. Caught a lot of good ones off that dock over there. But I don't see shit. They're back over there, ain't they? No? I don't see them anymore. Yeah, be careful because there's a lot of stuff down there. I'll be sure to find it. Get in that dock. Good bite. Oh, he came off. Dad gum it. That felt decent. Oh, you hooked him way out here. Yeah. Can't believe he bit that far out. Almost broke a rib setting the hook on her. Just about flipped the boat over. Yeah, I thought you were going overboard. <laughs> hey, at least I had a bite. Confidence booster. Yeah. I know there's still hope for me. Hey everyone, thanks for checking out the video. If you enjoyed it, leave me a like and comment below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Fishing's about to get a lot better. Spring is coming soon. Catch you next time.